Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is a little different because I'm back in LA. Got my little pupper here. He's being a little bad today. He's like not letting me work right now, but because he's used to me just kind of like catering to all of his needs. But also I have to kind of fault myself because I spoil him so much. Today's video is going to be a Amazon haul video, what I bought on Amazon. And I think that you guys are actually gonna really like this video because I got a lot of stuff that I feel like you guys are gonna really like. I feel like these are things that you're going to use often. So I did like kind of two weeks, three weeks of ordering things, trying things, testing them out. I'm also going to do a kind of room tour. I redecorated my room. I kind of re, yeah, basically redecorated it. Um, still waiting for a couple pieces. And actually later in the video, I'll probably tell you guys what I'm planning to do, which is gonna be kind of a big deal. So anyways, I'm going to just go ahead and get into this video now. Since we are on the subject of room decor, I bought this blanket, this throw blanket right here from Amazon. And I really love it. First of all, I don't, I just use this for decoration strictly. I don't use this for anything else, but I love the color and it's actually pretty good quality. Um, I think it was like, I'm not, I'm not sure on prices, so if I say that it was a certain price and it's not, I'm just, actually I'm not going to even say prices. I want to say it was between like $20 to $30. So it was really that expensive, nice little throw, I just use it to decorate, to just throw it here onto my bed, just to give it a little bit of texture and dimension and stuff. You can find some like home decor on there as well. I found actually quite a few things on Amazon, actually no, sorry, not Amazon, Wayfair. Um, that I bought, which I'm gonna show you that in my other video. But anyway, so yeah, I got the throw, really love it. One of the things I got. Next, I'm gonna hop into skincare. Um, one of the things that I've been finding with my skincare lately is that my skin has really been loving Polish Choice. Um, I met them actually last year, early last year, I think, or maybe around this time last year. They were like rebranding at the time and they were just open to you know meeting influencers and stuff like that. So I gave their stuff a try and I was, very surprised because a lot of skincare just doesn't really work for me i'm very sensitive skin um i just can't use a lot of things uh but their skincare their line every time i use their stuff i haven't really noticed any like severe reactions to my skin i've actually been very pleased with it so i went ahead and bought some stuff on amazon i got the clear normalizing cleanser it's in this like blue bottle here and i really like this so far it has like i said not broken me out i've had a lot of acne on my forehead for some reason i don't know why but i've been breaking out a lot there my last period i just had like a crazy crazy breakout so that was a little bit frustrating but i went ahead and bought this and i've noticed within like the last five days that my skin has started to been clearing up and I haven't really been breaking out again. Next thing I got was this purifying clay mask, which I really love. It's not super heavy. It's not too tight on the skin. Um, I noticed with some clay mask, it feels just like it's like sucking the life out of your skin. And maybe that's what it's supposed to do. But this one I like is just really light and not too heavy. And I haven't noticed any breakouts with it. Because I've used other clay masks that are supposed to be purifying or whatever. And... I'll get a breakout like the next two days for some reason. I don't know if it's because it's like getting all the toxins out or it's just my skin is too sensitive. Got another Paula's Choice Radiance Renewal Mask and this is with Be um, Bear Berry, Bear Berry and Vitamin C and it helps restore radiance and visible improved skin, visibly improved skin. As soon as I put it on, I like my face is like just so glowy and like pretty and I like really like it. So um, that's what I like about it, but I've been using it for the past three days. I haven't really noticed something dramatically different, but um, I just like the way it makes my skin look after I use it. It just gives it like a nice like glow. So, I mean, it does do what it's supposed to do, but as far as like getting rid of like hyperpigmentation or anything like that, I haven't seen that because I haven't been using it that long, but I do like the way it makes my skin look. The next thing is called Jujug, and I'm not really sure like if that's how you say it, but I want to say this is Korean skincare type of thing. I could be wrong though. But um, this is, this thing right here is, oh my gosh, it's these knees, guys. Okay, so like I said, I had a lot of acne on my forehead. Uh, if you guys want to see a skincare tune in video or something like that, I would love to do one because I want to show you guys how I use this. This little fine tip, and I don't want to really touch it because I don't like touching it with my hands, but um, this fine tip is very, very slim. And it helps just kind of like push out all the white heads it gets to the black heads it has three different uh, excuse me four different um vibrations so it helps kind of like move that acne without like or move the 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 sebum i should say in the skin up to the surface and helps it kind of come out which is amazing i'm telling you i did this on my forehead yesterday i washed my face after because i had i put a mask on and then i washed my face after and my forehead was 
the most shiny and just like it looked like oh my gosh it just looked amazing i was like oh my goodness this is awesome i love this thing i've noticed a i've noticed a difference like within the past five days it's it's awesome it's freaking awesome i love this thing i think everybody should have this honestly it's better than getting like the pimple popper because the pimple popper i feel is like really brutal on the skin i know it helps like push things to the surface but for me personally like i said i have sensitive skin so certain things i just can't use and that was one of them i just felt like it was like breaking my skin versus like really pushing the pimple out without like breaking my skin anyway love that so much i think you guys should try it um my esthetician is the one that actually i had two different estheticians that use it on me and i was like why don't i just buy one for myself since i can't always go to the i mean covid and everything i can't just go to the you know to get a facial or whatever so i wanted to buy it which brings me to my next tool that i've got and this is from pure daily care an actual dermal cell energy amplification system and i would say before you guys use this do your research on it because it is kind of like for professional use but since i like i said before i can't really go to the to get facials or the people that i usually go to aren't really like taking that many clients in right now i need some extra tlc on my face and i can't just you know i can't wait what comes in here is four different heads and then the body that you know you use the heads with it's a high frequency um tool that helps rejuvenate the skin also helps with hyperpigmentation acne a lot of different um a lot of different things that you can actually use this for i noticed such a difference when i was getting it done to me so i'm gonna try it myself and see what you know happens but i'm really excited to see like how my skin does with this um excuse me if you see Tui just like in the background he wants to be an influencer so bad like ugh. but anyway the one head that i got used on me a lot was this mushroom head here i i just noticed a big difference so if you guys want to see a skincare routine video like i said let me know because i would love to show you guys how that is used as well so i also bought a um aroma i bought this from aroma and it's scented um it's one of those air pure not air purifiers but the essential oils that you can use to like you know make your apartment smell really good or your house smell really good and the scent that i got from aroma is the hotel scent and it smells so good like i don't know if you guys like know like when you go to a certain hotel there's just like this really just refreshing smell in there um certain hotels obviously but there was this one hotel i went to and this it reminds me like that scent just takes me back to like that moment i was at that hotel it's so weird but i don't know if a lot of ho different hotels use this specific one specific one but it just oh, it just smells so f it's um no animal testing vegan no gmo pet friendly 100 percent natural diffuser friendly um no additives and no synthetics so it's really really clean which i like as well i mean obviously i have a pet make sure that he's you know not going to get affected by it at all so yeah this one i can't remember the price i think i want to say it's like oh i want to say it's like 30 bucks i think or it might be 10 i don't know i'm gonna just put all the links down in the description bar for you guys also i got a uh air essential oil user purifier thing i don't even know what it's called it's like i think it's called a diffuser I got it in this wood color because i just feel like it would match the house you know and like i can just set it and it can, can be it can kind of be like a decorative piece um like i said i'll put it down in the description bar for you guys but um this is what this is for so yeah i just can't wait everything has to just smell good like why do you not want to smell good smelling good is like should be an accessory it should be like when you do your hair like you should want to smell good you just want to split. Okay, so the next thing I got was some fitness stuff. Um, I also have a, a sweatband. It's a sweet sweatband that you can get on Amazon, but I can't find it right now. I love that sweatband. I've used it quite a few times. Not as much as I should, but I've used it a couple times. I love the way that it's already like kind of like getting me right down here. I don't want to show you guys because right now I'm a little like I'm a little self-conscious about my belly. I don't know, like it's not big but it's not tight and i'm like Ugh. no I, I should show you guys like how my belly looks i think i'll like when i like get over like my insecurity of it i got some resistant bands and these are the peach bands i saw really good reviews on these um there's i want to say there's four different levels right yeah so there's four different brands this is the light band this obviously i haven't used it yet i just i literally just got it though i got the medium band there is a heavy band and then there's the extra heavy band so i'm gonna put these to use 
I'm gonna do some at home workouts. I don't mind being slim. Like I'm not really looking to like gain gain. I'm just looking to have tight abs and a tight butt and my legs be like tight. I'm not really looking to like get bigger anymore. Like I was before I was like, okay, like I know once I gain muscle mass, I'm gonna be looking thicker, but I don't really wanna gain any more weight. I just want to be fit. I think that's like my goal now because I'm I'm pretty happy with my the way my body looks right now like I like that it's just slim I have a little bit of something going on but nothing too much because I'm I'm cool I'm cool I'm cool for now when I have kids and my body goes you know in different directions then maybe <laughs> then maybe I'll be like okay I'm a thick girl now but I mean right now I'm just I'm cool with my body like I'm I'm fine then I also got these discs that you can use on the floor to like you know, I work out with as well. I feel like the discs really help with getting your body looking great. When I was ha when I did have a personal trainer, we used discs and I hated it. I hated it so much, but it really helps. So also bought like some kind of like not miscellaneous, but stuff that I would actually use. I got these like hair clips, you know, to help me when I'm using doing my hair and stuff, like working with my wigs on my wig stand. They're really good. They really like grab the hair and keep it in place. So that's why I really love these little clips. And I also got some headbands when I'm doing my makeup and I'm washing my face. They came in three different colors. I got like white, gray, and black. When I get things dirty, it just looks less you know dirty so next we're moving on to some kitchen stuff that i bought i was like i really need these things they're really not a necessity but i'm like a coffee tea drinker now i'm trying to be a tea drinker but i'm still a little bit of a coffee drinker like i'm trying to get off of coffee because i noticed that one my skin has been doing terrible and i feel like it's all the sugar and then two i just don't want to be addicted to it like that like i don't want to have to have it every single day i try not to drink it a couple days and i had like terrible headache i got these straws these metal straws just to um you know save the planet uh <laughs> so got this mug this is like for coffee and tea and things like that so they're really thick only thing is when amazon delivered it one of them was broken so just i mean beware of that i guess um but yeah one of them came broken and then i got a frother i love frothing i'm a frother i don't know if that's a thing but i love frothing um I use it my teas I use it for my, for my well I was using it for my coffee but I use it all the time I just love foam and it just makes the things look like cool and nice and yummy I don't know I don't know I don't know I just love frothing so I forgot to add that I bought a cute little mini fridge for my skincare um, it's very portable, which is cool, and it's like, it doesn't take up a lot of space as well. I'm gonna link it down for you guys in the description bar, but this is what the inside looks like. Um, you can put your face mask in the side there, um, just like to hold that in there. You can put your moisturizers, serums, all kinds of things in here, so it's really, really cool. I'm so glad I got one finally, and yeah. All right, last but not least, I got something that's not from Amazon, but you guys ask me about it all the time. It's from Shake and Go. They are the Pony Pro Easy Wrap Around Ponytail. So I got them in three different styles. I got the Body Wave, I got the um, Super Curl, and then I got the Natural Yaki. So um, these are all three of the ponies. They are my favorite ones to use, even though they are synthetic. It just gives off this nice natural look and it's like it looks like a real it looks like real hair like it looks really good I, I love how it looks on my hair I feel like it just blends in really well and since I don't really know how to do those like wrap around ponytails without the with you know with the extension and all that I, I no, just not me I like it easy I don't have like to do too much work I just want to hurry up and do it and they're inexpensive I think they're like 14 bucks right now they're so inexpensive but they're really easy to use and they last a long time I had my last one for like two three months and usually you know with like synthetic hair you can only use it like a couple times but I used that last one that I had for well, you, I'll post some pictures in here I've used that so many times so many times so I really like it I think you guys should you know go on there and and try them yourself because they're really like they're, they're wrong. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you guys want to see more Amazon hauls or anything like, you know, haul videos, just let me know because I love sharing like what I get. I buy so much stuff and I'm like, I, I might as well just tell you guys where, like, you know, put you in game. I have like an announcement that I'm going to, I'm not sure if I'm going to tell yet. I'm going to wait until, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait until, I'm just going to wait. It's kind of life changing a little bit. But I'm going to tell you guys soon. That's pretty much it for today's video. Please give me a thumbs up if you liked it. And let me know if you guys try anything that I mentioned in the video. Or if you have anything that I mentioned in the video. And I will see you guys in my next one.